peace, 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 love, prosperity, abundance, self-love, self-care, wisdom, knowledge, patience, understanding, understanding, rest and standing, or the four corners of the year standing. <sighs> Family, there's a saying that a time will come, right? A time will come, your degree won't matter. Your education won't matter. And little by little, that time is is drawing near, it's getting closer. So, you know, I'm, a, I'm an intern, I'm still interning. And um, I have a temporary position, that's because my therapist is on maternity leave, she's coming back soon. So technically, you know, it's like I'm, an e- I'm interning and getting paid as an intern, let me put it that way. But some of my classmates, they graduated. I'm graduating in May this year. Some of them already graduated. They can't find jobs. And most of the jobs that are available for them, the places, the facility, the pay is so bad. The pay is so, so bad. It makes you regret going to school for four years. The pay is so bad. It's, it's disrespectful. It's, dis, it's discouraging. It is. It is. And most of the the, um, the places when you try to apply for job or you applying for work, they ask you for two years experience. And the question is, if I just graduated from college and I did my internship. The ideology behind internship, the concept of internship or interning is to gain not just the book knowledge, but to have hands-on knowledge, hands-on training. And every job, I started working at 17, so any job, every job that I know that you get hired to do, they train you. How do you expect, let's say you graduate from high school at 18, right? So 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. Let's say at the age of 22 or 23, you graduated with your bachelor's degree and you are being asked to present it, to have a two-year experience. How is that possible? How is it possible? I'm thinking about maybe pushing for my master's because initially I was supposed to be graduating this year with my master's degree. But then when I, I took a break because I didn't want to take that, I took a break and I ended up taking my energy class and I am grateful. I am grateful that I, I did that. Because right now, with your degree, you, my brother told me to get into IT. He said, you sis, get into IT. I'm like, I don't know nothing about in- computer. I am not good with computer. He said, sis, that's where the money is at. So think about it. If we all start shif- shifting to IT, then the pay rate for IT will decline because not everybody's jumping there. I have a few girlfriends that are nurses. When I go out and I, I post a video and you see me makeup, that's one of my girlfriends. She's a nurse. That's her side gig. I have another friend who is a nurse because they only work three days, but they do 12-hour shift for the three days. She has to go look for another, a second job as a nurse again in another facility. All my friends that are nurses, my best friend is, 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 is going to graduate next year to become a nurse too. But so far, all my girlfriends that are nurses, they all have a side hustle. They all have a side hustle. Does it mean that our, our degrees, our education don't matter anymore? Because holding a, an associate's degree or holding a bachelor's degree, you're supposed to have a decent job that you can literally care for yourself. Even a two family or like me being a mom with a son, I should be able to do that. But no. If I don't get people hit me up, hey princess, 
I need I need some Reiki. Boom, quick buck. Quick buck. I will have to get another job. If I want to live the comfortable life that I want. This economy is pushing most of us. This economy is pushing most of us to get with people we don't even want to get with. Because one income is not working. So it's pushing us for, for us to be with people that we know we don't want to be with. But again, so we can combine our income. Is education becoming less and less important, um, uh, not important, devalued? De 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 One of my therapists want to go back to school and take this class. The, the class I'm taking right now, I'm going to be taking in a couple of weeks. It's called CTRS. Because most of the job that I check online, like for the past two days, it's like, $35, $40 an hour, $45, between $35 to $45 an hour, and they're requesting for CTRS. That's the class I'm taking right now. It's a new class that they introduced um, uh, to my major. So people that graduated, let's say, three years ago, if they didn't take the CTRS, the stick exam, and they want to take it now, they have to go back to school and pay out of pocket so they could, they could take that CTRS. But I'm lucky enough, I have a few dollars for financial aid that is covering for that one class. So I can take that class and get the permission to take the CTRS. If you want to make good money, you have to get a master's degree. I'm going to have to get a master's in occupation. So I can make decent money where I can travel every maybe every, twice a year, live comfortable, get a three-bedroom apartment. And tell my, I can keep my three-bedroom apartment and tell my brother, brother, you can move if you want to move because I got it. But guess what? The more you work, the less time you have a home. The more you work, the less time you have a home with your, with your kids. The more you work, the less time you have for yourself. Your, your body gets tired. Some of them work two jobs. Some of the people I'm, where I, I'm, I'm interning at, they have two jobs. You're doing nine to five, five days a week, and you still got a second job. So you tell me, when do you have time to sit down and analyze your life? When do you have time to even get, 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 get some cleansing? When do you have time to even think? Because you're not going to think. That's the whole point. The whole system was designed to F with your thinking, your brain, cognition. How do you detect that this, the system ain't right if you are busy looking for money, if you are busy chasing money? You're not going to have time because the only way you can see what the problem is is to sit down and say, mm, and start looking and putting things together. That's how you know that the system ain't right. That's how you know that the world ain't right. Some, some, some ain't right. But you don't see it because you're busy. You're working out. If you go to work in the morning, it's, 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 the clouds is nice and blue. You, you get out of work, it's, it's dark. It's black outside. Then you got to go to another job. You're busy. You're tired. Your body is tired. My advice to you is, man, if you, and, and I ain't saying don't go to school, don't. I ain't saying that. I got medical assistant certification. I have associate's degree. This is my bachelor's. Listen, I ain't saying don't go to school because then if I said it, I'm being a hypocrite. I'm being a bad influence. Anything you do in this world, you need education. It might not be a classroom education, but everything is education. If you learn how to cook, it's education. Somebody's educating you. If you learn how to sew, do crocheting, it's educating. So I ain't going to say don't, even if you want to be a cashier, they got to educate you how to use the, the register. So everything is education. But if you have a talent, please don't let go. Work on it. Work on it. Work on it. People are struggling out here. People are. People are struggling. And it takes... It's only a few people that see it. The change will happen when the majority of the people see it. I was trying with one of my classmates, and we were talking about it, and she finally sees it. She sees it. I was, when we started our internship, I was telling them, they thought I was crazy. But now she sees it, and I'm like, you see it, but the world don't see it. It's only a few people that get it. 
And she said, I, I pray that things change. How do you expect somebody that just graduated to have a two-year experience? Indirectly, they're telling you they don't need you. And you know what they do sometimes too? They hire people that don't have a degree in that, on, in that field, right? They hire them because maybe they, they've been there for a long time, so they know how to do the work. And, 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 and you as a person with a degree, they're not gonna hire you because they, they have to pay you a certain amount. But because this person doesn't have it, let's say I'm supposed to get paid $35, right, with my degree, $35 an hour. They, they, they have somebody who don't have a degree, but has knowledge on the job, have the experience, they will hire that person and pay them $25. And that person will be happy, right? Because they have the experience, but they don't have the degree. I have the experience because I did my internship, but I don't have a two year experience. Do you see how, do you see how they play the system? So what they want us to do, volunteer and work two years for free so we could have that experience? Because if you don't hire me, how am I going to get the experience? And if the person did an internship, that means they have an experience. It might not be two years because it's internship is not that long. It's just a semester. And, 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 and look at what is happening now. You could just sit down and make a reaction video and make money. People are putting their, their, their babies, their children on social media and they're making money. Somebody will just do, the, do a little cooking and they'll make money. They're brushing their, their kids' hair, they're making money. They're feeding their dog, they're making money. Doesn't mean that little by little our degrees won't matter anymore. Doesn't mean that little by little people ain't gonna be working anymore and they will still get paid, cashless society. They say, well, don't work and, and everybody going to be equal. Whether you work or don't work, we are all going to be the same. I mean, if you can make 30 seconds video, comb me your little girl's hair, and, and you're getting a million views, you're making money. Why would you want to go sit in an office? Why do you want to be in a hospital looking at, at sick people? No, you don't. All you got to do is do a little dance video with your husband, 30 seconds, 20 second dance video, and you're making millions of views. What you need education for? You don't need no degree. If all I got to do is get in fight, fight people, and I will blow, what you need college degree for? Does it mean that little by little our education is really not going to matter? Again, if you have any talent, work on it. Because no matter what, no matter what, I have mines. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a Reiki master. And as long as people hit me up for some healing, I'll, I shall survive. I will survive. It's getting tough out here, and I ain't here to scare you. I just like to talk about real things, things that are really happening. The more people see the, the world, the way I see, the way you see it, the more people are aware that we are being played. That's how the change will come. But until then, we're going to keep working, struggling and working two jobs, in and out, working, working past each other on our phones. We're not going to see nothing because our brain, our mind is occupied with a lot of stuff, a lot of things. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you. They said, once upon a time, a time will come, school will not matter, your degrees won't matter. And it's happening, it's getting closer, it's getting near. Mm -hmm. And then to go, to, 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 go, to, to, to pay for, 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 for master's degree, that's a lot of money. Some, some people are in nursing school and they have to pay, they have to get student loan. Now you get in out, you gotta pay the student loan. If I wanna get my master's right now, I have to get a student loan. Then I have to work and pay that off. Another, another stress. You see how they playing with us? So every day, you constantly battling in your, in your mind, in your head. This is what they're doing to us. I hope that people see, more people see and take a stand. That's the only way.
We need more people. Majority carries the vote. If people can gather the strength and walk away, I'm telling you, they will submit to our demands. But again, if you don't do it, 20 other people will do it. Look at all the immigrants that's coming in. If you don't want to take one dollar and deliver the food, that immigrant that just came in America will take 50 cents and deliver the food. So this is why we keep losing. But I know the one day the people shall wake up. African kisses. One love.